Thank you Playmobil for sending Squirrel Stampede these Scooby-Doo toys for free. Hey Scoobs, hot dog. Root. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, ghost squirrels. Oh no. Squirrel. Thank you. On the table today, we are going to be exploring this really cool Scooby Doo mystery machine from Play. Yeah. This really cool Playmobil. Yeah. Stop. Where are these guys coming from? I'm sorry, I have a little bit of a ghost squirrel problem right now. But if we can get through this, we've got this amazing. <laughs> And there we are on the table with the Playmobil Mystery Machine. 72 pieces with Fred, Daphne, and Velma. Scooby and Shaggy are sold in a separate set with a ghost, both full of pieces to explore. As you can see from the back of the box, Playmobil pretty much the undisputed champion of accessories. There are many pieces inside these sets. Inside the Mystery Machine box, one Mystery Machine to build. This bag has Fred, Daphne, and Velma. This bag has some important pieces to build. Better have a main windscreen. There's some tires for the machine of mystery. The all important, uh, whatchamacallit. The roof. And almighty instructions. 72 pieces of mystery to go through. I like that there's a little bit of model building to this. Let's check out these instructions. Those are wheels. These are instructions. Even more pieces in the instructions bag. And we have a good Playmobil booklet of Scooby-Doo, and I think even inside we've got some great fun facts of our favorite characters over the years. And then we can build our mystery machine, several steps included. Did I mention I like how it's kind of like a model? Let's explore some more of these bags. Uh, here we go. Whoa, there's a lot of pieces in there. Is this the mystery machine or, or Rocky's recycle truck? Pretty sure I know where that goes. Little pieces. Always lose some of those. Almost too many accessories with Playmobil sometimes. Tires. Are you tired of opening tires? Sometimes people ask. And of course, Fred, Daphne, Delma. I think that's pretty much everything out. Some extra stickers and character cards for some reason. And I think we are now finally all set to build. There it is, your mystery machine, about a 5 to 10 minute setup. First impressions, this is probably the most detailed mystery machine I have played with to date. And the Happy Meal mystery machine was not happy about that comment. Oh, I take it back, it was Burger King. This is a full on Mystery Inc. Ghost Explorer vehicle though. Plenty of adventure with this van. We can start by removing the windscreen. We have seats for two up front, plus drink holders. Again, the Playmobil accessories are second to none. Place your Freddy figure inside for drive. A little bit tricky to get Fred in there, but he is seated. Maybe the only detail of criticism here would be usually you see all three up front, but I think once Daphne gets inside, there's not much room for Velma, but that's okay because there are plenty of seats in the back. Uh, it looks like they forgot the front flower tire though. Too bad. So to get to the back there are many different ways. We can remove the back roof. We can open the side van door. 
We can't even open the back doors. For plenty of location play. There are four spots to sit in the back. We've got two green chairs behind Daphne and Fred and a nice orange bench chair that folds down. And you can actually switch those two around if you want the orange bench chair behind Daphne and Fred and the green chairs in the back. Then there is the almighty ghost computer thing back here. Almost like the Ecto-1 from Ghostbusters. Something going on here. Hard to exactly see, but we have these little screen clips here. There's three included. I think there could have been more. There's spots for more. Slide them in here. And then you press this button and they'll light up. And you can kind of see the glowiness of that map or whatever they're looking at. Photos of the gang. Plenty of stuff to do back there though. We even have a tray of food, a hot dog, a pizza and a donut. We have a map accessory, we've got a flashlight, we've got a magnifying glass, a camera. Plenty of stuff for the gang to use. And of course, character stickers. Overall, pretty impressive what they've accomplished with this mystery machine. Let's of course bring out Shaggy, Scoobs, and the ghosts now. These darn squirrel ghosts just move away for a second. Inside the box. Instructions. Playmobil set guide. More stickers of the gang. Oh, there we go. There's another slide for the van. And a ghost. And let's get these guys out. Okay, there's everything included with the ghost set. Hey Scoobs, you're looking a little rougher than I expected. He's got a little gray sheen to that shine. We'll worry about that later, let's get these guys together. Where's Scooby's collar? That might help. And there we go with these three. Scooby looks remarkably better with his collar on. I knew something was missing there. There's still a little bit of that Playmobil roughness plastic to it, but it's a really fun articulated moving Scooby fig. Thank you. Even with moving mouth and tail, you can't rotate the head though. There is a funny stand for Scooby to stand him up. I imagine if we tried, we might even be able to dress him in a costume or something. <laughs> Pretty cool to see that display stand included. Shaggy's looking pretty good too. They've done pretty well playmobilizing all these classic characters. We do have a spare slide with a ghost or phantom. So I believe all the ghosts will come with a slide that you will be able to use in your mystery machine. Placing them in this slide holder. Other accessories, we've got a great buildable hamburger, some Scooby snacks, and this cool rope catchy ghost thingy. And of course the phantom. I believe this is the phantom worn by Blue Stone, the great magician. Remove the helmet and there he is. Himself underneath. Nothing beats classic Scooby-Doo where all the ghosts were actually villains. None of this real ghost stuff. One more thing to open, we have a Playmobil Series 1 Scooby-Doo 12 Ghosts to Collect Mystery Figure. Oh, who could it be? This is the most exciting part of the collection, I think, is finding out all these different ghosts to look for. Who do we got? Minor 49er? I think it is. I think it's Minor 49er. Love building these guys. I'm going to have to pick up a few more of these somehow. I really don't want to pull a lot of repeats this year though. So let's see. How do we build this guy? Also known as the caretaker. But I like Minor 49er. It's just fun to say. So very cool to see. And here are some of the others you can find in Series 1. Just a classic collection there. Oh, I like the Black Knight. Oh, all of them are going to be fun to play with. One more time with the gang up close. They've done so well with these. A quick Fred comparison. Here he is in Lego minifigure form. Here's Fred in Imaginext form. So about the same scale as Imaginext. And Fred in large scale action figure form. Hi, guys. Everyone's done a pretty good job capturing Fred. Whoop. So now all we have to really figure out is where are all these ghost squirrels coming from? Jinkies, that's easy. It's been apparent the whole time. I can't believe you haven't figured it out yet. 
Zoinks, man! Ghost Squirrel Scoobs, we gotta get out of here! Oh, relax, Shaggy. I think we can all calm down if Tiny Chipmunk Squirrel stops projecting ghost squirrels. <laughs> squirrel? Squirrel, squirrel! Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, this must have been the ghost squirrel projector then. Good work, team. Oh, now, Squirrelzilla. So the mystery machine turned out really cool from Playmobil. I am super impressed. Just all the detail, all the extra accessories, all the doors that open, chairs that flip up and down, spots for everybody, rolls really nice. This is a great set to look out for. It's gonna run for about 45 bucks. Thank you again, Playmobil, for sending this over. If you had not, I would have totally picked this one up myself for sure. And uh, the Scooby pack with the ghost, that runs about 15. And I believe all the ghost packs out there run about four. So if you're looking for a really fun, super Scooby-Doo, the Mystery Machine Playmobil set, check these out. They have been a ton of fun. <laughs> oh no, they're back! They're back! Ah! Yeah! Don't forget to follow Squirrel Stampede on TikTok, Pop Jam, Instagram, and comments up on Discord. Thanks for watching!